Welcome on back. I think we're on episode four of Basketball GM. Four or five. I don't need to check. Um, the points and videos we got up right now. So, this season we did not make the playoffs. If you haven't watched the last three episodes, please do so. I'm going to create a playlist for you guys. Watch this and the Minecraft videos are up. I'll see what else I can do after that. Just want to say that. Let's start the video. Alright. Bad year. Tank a little bit. In terms of popularity. The other teams want to hire me. I want to rebuild this team. I want to. We got a high draft pick right here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to trade up for the first pick in the draft. They want three picks. They want all three of my picks to do it. There are two picks here in my next year's pick. Ugh, I'll do it. It's Maurice Stokes is, again, a player that I think he can help turn, turn our team around. Alright. Let's take a look here. We're bringing back Murphy. Holland. Um, Irv. We're bringing back Irv. And after that, we're going to be bringing back... We're going to let these guys walk. And we'll see what's up for free agency this year. Jack Molinas, who's 59, could potentially be 65. I'll bring him in. Is he not? Doesn't like me. Whatever. Cool. Deal. I guess. Alright. Okay, so that's our sort. For the first time in a minute. So, okay. Kelsey's back at the point guard. Maurice, we're going to bring down the center. Murphy will play Paul or power forward. Malonis will come in at small forward. This means, for the first time in a really hot minute, George Meekin is not a starter. He's falling on his team a bit too much, I think, and, you know, it makes sense. Yeah, I can see him. He's going to be six man, I think. Besides that, you know, Murphy's been here for ten years. Malonis looks like he could be something. Tommy, if anything, Malone is the one in trouble on this team. I would take Malone this out. He doesn't, doesn't play and bring in Meekin and move Stokes and Murphy up. For bench players, Red Morrison, our draft pick is moving up nicely. Our old draft pick is moving up nicely. Blaine, Joe, Sal, George Crafton, all doing good for a bench. We have a strong bench, decent starters. Let's see how it goes, guys. Hey, we're in a. See me the All-Star game. See our team heads up. Okay, so we got Keith, Meekin, and Stokes. I bet you Meekin's gonna earn six man of the year season. Um Cowsy. Cowsy, Cowsy, Cowsy. I'm I'm gonna see my options for Kelsey because he's just he's falling off just too much for me. Just just too much. We can't get anything here. Okay, middle record. We need to figure something out because his team isn't working. So I'm gonna move Malona's out, Meekin up, and we're gonna go back to this. Let's see if Kelsey's stats can improve. Just anything. Is any improvement from Kelsey would be good. Okay, so the improvement for Kowsey, let's take a look here. He did improve by the end of the season, which is what I want. We're running to think of Meekin, Stokes, Murphy, Tommy, and Bob was Jack on the six man with crap and balling him. Alright, so. Let's check the playoffs. Okay, we got the bench cap list up here. This could be a really good opportunity. Because no one is dominant this year besides muscle. And even then. That's the most dominant record. So let's see. Can we beat up Boston Massacre, our former rivals, who have Eddie Miller, Vern Mickelson, Ed Fleming, among others? Let's find out. We do. Take on the Venture Capitalist. Venture Capitalist. Gala. Horgensen. Gala is better than Horgensen at this point, which is scary because Gala is really... Horgensen was really good as prime. And he's still outperforming Gala. But whatever. 
Their bench, though, is I think our bench is better than theirs. Let's see if we can get something. We do. All right, we're taking on the Fort Wayne Muscle. Fort Wayne Muscle. Here we go. They don't have Ray Phoenix, Felix. They still have Brown, Hazen, Harrison, Christensen, who we trade him. Christensen. But they do not have Felix, which is going to be good for us. Their bench is strong. Can we get the second belt under our second trophy? We can. Wow. From no playoffs to a championship title once again. The New York Bankers have won again. So we've gone from not making it even close to the playoffs in a high draft pick, first draft pick, all the way to winning the whole thing with our Rookie of the Year, Maurice Stokes. I think he should be Rookie of the Year, I was just going to say. Shocked if he wasn't. Yeah, Maurice and George Meekin was 13. So there's, there's going to be maybe some changes, I think, if we're going to continue this. Obviously, we're doing good. We're doing good right now, but we need to make some changes. We're going to keep this streak going. We don't have a draft this year. We're missing out on Bill Russell. Legend, I, IRL. And we're missing out on a bunch of people. But it's okay. we got a good roster. We can take the fourth pick in the second round. Pick up Bob Burrow. Alright, now here's where we got to start making some decisions. I want to keep George Meekin, obviously. And we're going to be letting some people go. I was going to say George. I thought George was up this year, but no. We're going to keep Sal. Because he's going to get back up. But that's it. Er, keep Fred Christ. We'll keep Fred Christ. Besides that, we're letting go Carl and Tommy. The guys are old. They're decreasing in skill level. I don't want to, like... Have him just continue to be the most. Even though I told you guys Tommy was legend, we want to keep him. I just I want to get someone good. Come on. It's like Vern Mickelson. Be that guy. 61 point for 16 points, 7 rebounds at 5 assists. We're bringing in Vern. And we're going to be linked to preseason. Let's see roster looks. So. Obviously, some trainers. I want to get rid of Bob Cowsey. I really do, because I don't know what I want. Can we get him for anything good? Does anyone want... Okay. Paul Hoffman, no. Those guys are over 30. I want someone at least... I can get three young guys and try to rebuild, I guess. Uh, let's just keep Cowsey, I guess. Alright. Bob, Murphy, Vern... Meekin is still a client, but he's still, for some reason, really good, so I'm not going to mess with his record, or his shtick, I guess. I guess they want me to mess with his shtick, whatever. Maurice, Tommy, Vern, John, got the whole pack squad here. Sal, Holland, Captain, Moline, or Milanes. Megan's down though. I want to bring him a little more up since I don't think Megan's going to go that deep decline. We'll find out though. Yeah, Megan's putting up good numbers. Same thing with Blaine. Blaine's a really good piece for us. Alright, we got our first all star and our all star captain in a minute. And Maurice Stokes. We're going to do the whole. Pick our team strategy. Just like does it. Joe Holland made it. Wow. At 32. That's really cool. I didn't expect that. Alright. See if we can win. We do. But Tommy O'Keefe takes the MVP award. Really good job there, my Keith. All right, roster. We're going all the way. We have a good record. Can we go double? Can we get the double? Double rings. So we're going to simulate the other round. The venture capitalists are up. This might be our toughest challenge because looking at the records, they're not that good. <laughs> they got Gala, Noble, Ed, 
Ron, Bob. Those are five guys we had to watch out for. But Bench is the only Hoffman, really, because everyone else kind of declined or rising. Rising prospects and declined veterans. I don't know. I think we can take it, but I don't want to get cocky, obviously. We'll see how our team does. Ooh, 3-1 sweep for the Venture Catalyst, and that might do it for them. Yep. Tom Gala wins his first championship. Noble gets another ring. Um, Reese Stoke wins MVP. Bill Russell's automatically best player in the year. 16 rebounds. That man's insane. Yeah, dug that record off. Any chance we got for anyone else getting it? All right, one more season before the video ends. This is a weird draft class. Not the best, honestly. All right, we're gonna pick Bill Ebron and Worthy Patterson, I guess. Here, just looking at like I don't know. Doug Blast, both rough. We don't want to prep any of those guys, but whatever. Okay, Cowsey wants 100k. <sighs> mm. I don't know if I want to do it. I'm gonna let Cowsey go. This might be a mistake because I can still sign him. Mm. <laughs> I just realized I could. I was gonna. Yeah. I thought I was going to, but, oh yeah, that would have been a bad choice. The best one would be Dick McGuire, I guess. Yeah. Alright, I don't really, we'll see what happens coming to the next season. Alright, everybody goes down. That's not what I liked. Bob Burrow went up a bunch, though, Jesus. Same thing I've read. Okay, so let's take a look here. Cowsey would be starting point guard still. Tommy will be shooting guard. Uh, let's take Vern out, put bot John Murphy in. I think Murphy can still hang. <laughs> we'll be making up because we know he's going to be good. And Bro will play center. Big injuries already. Oh, gosh, this is a bad year for us. We're going to get a high draft pick, I think. Yeah. All right, we get Marie Stokes and Bob Burrow. Pretty sure it's gone. One day. Yeah, Stokes wins it. Two-time winner at Oscar Captains. Good for Marie Stokes. So, 12.9, 15.7, 12 and 5. Bob Cowsey's being... Just Bob Cowsey. I don't really want Bob Cowsey either. I guess we can go full on rebuild. See if anyone here makes sense to pick up. Bob Santini. I really don't like Cowsey. He's not doing good as I want him to. Good old role player, but more st Stokes almost average triple double trying to carry this team to. A decent spot. How's George doing? Meekin. Uh, let's up his minutes because, you know, it's George Meekin. I keep doing that. Is there like a border or something I can like block? Whatever. Is there. I don't. I'm not going to screw with it right now. Alright. Oh, we clinched a spot. Oh, we clinched a spot. All right. So, we're going against the Syracuse Cheese Sticks. Cheese Stacks? Cheese Steaks. Bob Petit, Slick Lennon, Herb, Art, Richie, George King. This is a pretty stacked roster. Can we get the win? No, we cannot. You know, it's a good run. <laughs> Maurice Stokes gets it. The MP again. I think that's his third MVP in a row. It's a trilogy of MVPs. George and Ralph both retire and make Hall of Fame. Good for them. Cowsey make third team again. Yeah, alright. If you want to hire me, it's fine. Alright. 
that's our draft for or that's our bit that's it for this video. See you guys next time. Bye.